yet ready to witness a revolution in automotive innovation. After years of anticipation, Chrysler is back with a bang, unveiling the Halcyon and Ram Revolution truck concepts at the Detroit Auto Show. From sleek designs to groundbreaking technologies, these concepts signal a new era of creativity and progress in the automotive industry. Join us as we explore the future of driving and dive into the electrifying world of Chrysler's latest innovations. Let's go! Since 1989, the Detroit Auto Show has included Chrysler's newest concept cars. The 2008 financial crisis and bankruptcy restructuring that resulted in Chrysler's acquisition by Fiat and its subsequent integration into Stellantis halted the flow of creative concepts. The Chrysler Halcyon and Ram Revolution truck concepts debuted in 2023. Like the Revolution and 2022 Chrysler Airflow, the Halcyon is battery electric. Chrysler CEO Chris Fiel called the Airflow the brand's future as it moves to an all-electric portfolio in the coming years. The first electric Chrysler will be a more significant crossover like the Airflow, but it won't look like that. Airflow was a terrific first step to represent Chrysler's future. As Ralph Jill's Stellantis chief design officer, and I continue to collaborate and talk about how to bring harmony in motion to life for Chrysler and how to push the boundaries of contemporary and modern sustainable design, we knew we could get a little edgier with the vehicle because if people were comfortable with the airflow when we first introduced it in 2022, we thought our design was too conservative. Thus, the Halcyon is edgier metaphorically and literally. The sleek, streamlined Halcyon car has a sharp nose and tail edges that slash through the air. The electric STLA large platform, which doesn't need room for a big engine, gives it a cab-forward look like Chrysler's 1990s models. The big glass canopy stretches forward and below the hood, now an aero blade like the Dodge Charger Daytona concept. The car's top glass part has a dimmable coating like the Boeing 787's windows. The Halcyon's rear-hinged back doors and lack of a B-pillar allow for good inside views as usual. The proposal has butterfly-hinged sections above the doors for easier interior access. None of this will likely be produced. As usual, for a concept, many great features will never be in consumer vehicles and others will take years to develop. These include STLA Auto Drive Level 4. The front seats glide back and recline while the rear seats fold and slide back into the trunk in a novel stow-and-go configuration. The canopy lets passengers see the stars as the driving wheel slides into the dashboard and the windshield becomes opaque. However, Mercedes-Benz automobiles include augmented reality heads-up displays that replace instrument panels. As showcased at CES this year by numerous automakers, the STLA Brain Electronic Architecture supports AI chatbots that let drivers ask inquiries and operate features with speech. SDLA Smart Cockpit's Prepare Mode employs the AI Virtual Assistant to alert the driver of their day, while Welcome Mode leverages biometrics to tailor lighting, music, and screen welcomes. Dynamic Wireless Power Transfer charges the car as you drive along properly equipped roads, but it won't be produced soon. Today, just a quarter mile of these roadways remain in Detroit's Corktown district as test projects. Lithium sulfur batteries may appear later this decade or early next. Stellantis invests in Lighten, a business that invented 3D graphene to retain sulfur molecules in battery cathodes for longer cycle life than lithium sulfur batteries. If this can be commercialized, it might significantly lower battery costs since it needs neither nickel nor cobalt and sulfur is cheaper than existing cathode materials. Its production would emit 60% less carbon than existing batteries. Only the Pacifica minivan and Voyager fleet versions are still produced by Chrysler. The 2023 built 300 set in inventory should last until the third quarter. Fuel said many upcoming Chrysler EVs, beginning with a big crossover in 2025 and a sedan, will use housing design elements, including the stylized wing emblem. At least four models of an upper mainstream brand are still the goal, says Fuel. The June 19, 25 founded Chrysler Corporation was known for inventiveness. Our regular stream of creative ideas from the 1990s and 2000s may not return, but it would be appropriate if the brand were reincarnated as all-electric precisely a century later. It would be proper to commemorate a centenary and return to the Halcyon days of its first EVs arrive by mid-next year and contain at least some of the Halcyon's features. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comment section below. 
If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.